famous movie, Jurassic Park, is turning 30 years old this year, and is known to be one of the most successful dinosaur fil films in the world, making over one billion dollars in the global box office, and it has three movies that are in the modern world, and that's it. This Jurassic World with Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom and Dominion with the three Jurassic Park movies from the 90s to the 2000s. But how come its dinosaurs are different than their real life counterparts? Do you know the movie Jurassic Park is turning 30 years old? In this video, I'm going to talk about the differences between the dinosaurs in the movies and their real life counterparts with the help of prehistoric planets accurate dinosaurs. And let's start things off with the world's most popular dinosaur known to mankind, and that is Tyrannosaurus Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex was known as the monstrous creature of Jurassic Park. In Stan Winston's studio, they built a full-size animatronic T-Rex and they can use it for filming the movie with the help of practical effects with the mix with CGI creatures and practical effects in different shots of the movie. There is a different depiction of the real life T-Rex instead of Jurassic Park's T-Rex with the difference between the scientific accuracies of this particular animal. In recent years, we've known on how a T-Rex would have been grown and as it's grown up in, in different parts of life. Take this for example, this is the skull of a juvenile T-Rex and as you can see its skull looks much more different than the adults because when they are babies they have long legs with really short arms and a more leaner face and as they got older they were more chunkier with a pair of huge keratin crests with big eyes and lips similar to those of monster lizards and other sorts of lizards in the world today. The Velociraptors are monstrous creatures that were scaly reptiles that were about the size of a person with pronated arms with a unique feature and that is a sickle claw with cat-like eyes. But in reality, it was more like a bird than a reptile because dinosaurs were more like birds and it was based on Deinonychus which had a, a broader snout out with unique features like the sickle claws and so much more to its unique behaviour with bird-like pupils. And for the Brachiosaurus, it has elephant-like feet, an S-shaped nest, and a short tail and a large, tall crest on top of its head, with a unique feature like chewing food like a cow. But in reality, Brachiosaurus has more or a longer body with a longer neck, and with their nostrils, nostrils less it's higher than the uh, and on top of its crest because it's more based on a dinosaur called Giraffe Titan and that's completely different than other dinosaurs. Now Triceratops is one of the most famous horned dinosaurs known for its pre-horned face. In the Jurassic World version, it has elephant-like feet, cheek horns, and different shaped 
8 position where the eyes are at and other features that is just like create a massive poop pile. That is one big pile of shit. But in reality, Triceratops has a slender appearance with less elephant like features and a higher eye position and more unique horn shaped to now horns. And as for the stegosaurus and the chylosaurus, they are fairly accurate but the stegosaurus has a short neck in the uh, Jurassic appearance but it has a more different features with a longer neck, less elephant like feet, a bit slender and unique shapes on its plates and as for the ankylosaurus it is a bit more chunkier, more wider with different unique shapes of osteoderms and a different shaped skull with different shaped feet as well with a tail club as well. But there are so many dinosaurs that are different in the Jurassic universe and there are more dinosaurs to be discovered in every single week in every few years due to scientific discoveries and most of them is described in the documentary series Prehistoric Planet Season 2. As I watched the series I was amazed at the CGI I, with high quality 3D models of different creatures from dinosaurs, pterosaurs, marine reptiles and so much more into this show and Prehistoric Planet Season 1 and Season 2 is, is now streaming on Apple TV Plus this year and that's a wrap on this special video dedicated to the future of prehistoric and discussing all of the popular dinosaurs of Jurassic Park. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you never miss a brand new video on this channel. And don't forget our future is prehistoric with films like Jurassic Park and TV shows like Prehistoric Planet. Don't forget to subscribe and don't mind the hiccups in this video.